Good morning, Leos. Leos, Leos, Leos. I've never done a reading for Leo. Well, actually I have, but not officially. Uh, I have a friend that is a Leo, so I do readings for her quite often. And we're doing financial, doing a financial reading from now until December 15th, I believe. And I'm shuffling. If you're a cross watcher, welcome. This is for Leo. This is a message for Leo financially. What does the universe have to say for Leos? I'm so glad you're tuning in. Uh, gotta get, get more diligent on doing my readings for you guys. I've always done readings for Aquarians, but I have to, I have to branch out, <laughs> branching out. Okay. Let's see. What is the energy for Leo's today? Financial energy is, oh my, I just had, I just had this card. Yeah, I just had this card. This is the page of pentacles. Okay. That's the energy page of pentacles is, um, yeah, so the Page of Pentacles is all about <clears throat> being cheerful and being in a great mood. Um, what else? Uh, and, and bringing you messages, um, being prepared, being studious. Okay, those are the words on the card. Um, so that's that's the energy is prepare, prepare for something. And I'm and I'm guessing it's going to be something pretty big. Look at that. It is going to be something pretty big for you. Yes, yes, yes. So these are your events leading up. Um, you're the wizard. <laughs> um, current situation and future potential. And these are just your clarifying cards. Okay. And I'll pull a couple later or after. Okay, so financially, this so this is a financial reading, uh, and I'm not saying that this this is a predicting the future. This is just advice. Um, but the energy for this reading is the Page of Pentacles, which means that you've been doing your work. Okay, you you're doing the legwork, and you're and you are working. Hmm, you're doing as much as you can possibly do to succeed. Okay, the world. <clears throat> um, <clears throat> not the wizard, the world. <laughs> so the world is your oyster. Look at that angel. So that's you holding on to, holding on to the world. Okay, accomplishment, celebration, and completion. Okay, and so what I'm seeing here is um, the events leading up you have found your niche, you found it, okay? Um, and right now you're spinning that wheel, the wheel of fortune. It's up to you how this, how this goes, okay? It's completely up to you, it's not up to anybody else, it's up to you how you spin that wheel. Um, if you um, don't want the change, then certainly don't spin the wheel, don't, don't go there. Um, yeah, luck, progress, and change, okay? But you're the one that's spinning that wheel, okay? Um, page of fire, page of wands. Motivated, enthusiastic, and creative. Okay, so with, <coughs> pardon me, with the spinning of this wheel, what you're going to notice is once you fall, get your feet planted in that niche that you are thinking of doing, you, you have done some background work, you've done the research, you've tried this and you've tried that, and this doesn't work and that doesn't work. And now you're focusing on this one thing um, and you're going to, you're going to take a chance and I'm saying, go for it. I mean, if you don't take the chance, you'll never know. Okay, and so <clears throat> go ahead, spin that wheel, um, because 
what you're going to notice is that um, there's going to be a lot of enthusiasm for what it is you're doing. Okay, uh, lots and lots of the more enthusiastic you are, the more you believe in that niche that you have <clears throat> that you've been working on as far as financial um, goes, um, the more people are going to be drawn to you. They're going to see your excitement. They're going to see um, that you believe in what you're doing. And you're ultimately you're going to get a lot of a lot of um, support. Now, to clarify, <clears throat> okay, so to clarify, you have had a little bit of resilience um, uh, and yeah, so all the things that have been happening and Leo, you're, you're, you are very, Hmm. Not only are you very self-protective, but you are a protector. So you like to protect others and you, you bring in that, hmm, that lion energy. I am in charge. I am the boss. I am the king slash queen of my castle. I am in charge. And so everything that has happened to you leading up to, uh, your tower moment <laughs> i mean there's a lot of things that are going to come crashing down but i don't want you to to see that as yet another um another i guess you could say another roadblock uh, i want you to see it as an opportunity to spin that wheel okay and so <clears throat> over here you've been very very resilient uh, things have happened. Uh, you've tried this, you've tried that. Everything keeps crashing down. You don't get the support you need. Um, <clears throat> or, you know, other things keep coming in and stopping you from, from moving forward, from having that tower moment. Actually, a lot of them are uh, transformational moments. And so this particular moment, it's not just tower come crashing down it is a moment of transformation you're spinning that wheel um your creativity you're going to establish your niche you're going to move forward and then <clears throat> prosperity contentment and celebration okay prosperity contentment and celebration you're going to have some fun and yeah, so so you're going to really, really enjoy, um, you know, you'll, you're seeing these guys. Um, they're just having some fun. You're going to enjoy that new thing. You know, you've spun the wheel. You're, you're transforming as we speak. Um, and you're going to enjoy every moment of it. Um, keep moving. Keep keep working on what it is you're working on. Um, let me just clarify. Because if you if you stop, then you got to start all the way back at the beginning again. Wow, you're getting a lot of wands. Um, challenge, determination, resistance. Okay. And okay, so you've got. Um, another another wand here so be careful you don't get overwhelmed uh be careful that um you don't get too stressed uh, <clears throat> i just want to pull one more just to make sure yeah i mean after going through all of this and having many many transformations it can be overwhelming um i do see you coming out the other end happy and and cheering and just having a great time and nice nice so you've got the eight of cups empowerment fulfillment okay and you're going to be in the arms of your angel okay um you're walking towards that angel who is 
your support system. Okay. You do have some earthly support supports. <clears throat> absolutely. But ultimately your support is your spirit guides. Listen to that inner thought. Listen to everything that is going on inside your mind. It's not you speaking, it's your guides. Okay. So if you hear that little whispering behind your ear, listen to that little whisper behind your ear. Okay. Because it's more than likely it's your guide talking to you and guiding you. Okay. You can't see him right now, but your guide is telling you, go this way, keep going, keep going, you know, keep reaching for, for what, what it is that is going to make you fulfilled. Okay. Keep reaching. That was a good reading. Keep reaching. Imagine that one coming up as the, <laughs> as the, um, the energy card for abundance, for financial abundance. Have a great day, Leo, and thank you for tuning in.